Hey love bugs, it's Ross. I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended family, thank you so much for just allowing me to help you assist going towards that positive direction, getting that personal growth about yourself, learning more about your gifts, learning more about things that you probably didn't even know that collaborated with your gifts. So, which is a true blessing to be able to be granted with something like that. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell. When you know I'm about to upload my next video, oh my goodness, it'll <laughs> start itching like crazy. And yeah, go ahead and up, you know, give me hit the notification button, hit the notification button. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you're just opening up. Tell me about your empathic gift and how it impacted your life in a positive way, or just sent you towards a positive direction you never even thought of happening to you if you feel like the video has gave you good vibes and you'd like to share it with someone please do so and give me a thumbs up and like and even share on your social media favorites and thank you so much for stopping by my channel i hope you're able to you know resonate with the content of my video and this relaxing music i'm listening to, to today y'all is just oh my goodness it's so beautiful and relaxing and something i needed today it's called 432 hertz music balanced male female energy harmonize inner inner energy and feel i think that's siva and steak tea steak tea i think that's what that is so excuse me if i didn't say it right but anyways uh the video today i'm about to do is twin flame 101 Impasse, mistakes and delays are blessings which they truly are and i know sometimes I'm, i know you're like girl <laughs> you gonna get on my nerves saying that but it's true if you really look at it from a different concept it's like when you're going through it at that certain time you, it might get up and make you get up in your feelings because you might really want it that right now or you really hated that the fact that you had to postpone something that you really truly wanted to explore or had something to do or whatever you had to backtrack and do something else but everything has a reason for happening that way and it's just like you know you may have wanted this job or something like that and then if you end up being patient and waiting for something that was going to come through you know and i know it's hard to do at times especially if you're going through something like financial struggle and stuff like that well by all means do what you have to do but um if it's something that you know that you can wait patiently for you know because you might hear something else is getting ready to come up but you have to wait for like about a week and it, you have to do an assessment test so it's just like you know this job is like two times better than the job that you're working now you'll be able to have more flexible hours and you know spend some time with your family you know so it's basically saying everything that you want in your life anyway and and then you just end up not qualifying for this job you went but then the blessing is you went and studied for your your assessment test or whatever like that and um you got to learn things and you you know you had to memorize things you had to train your mind to certain things because this is something that you have studied in that field but you just haven't did it for a while so you had to go refresh your mind and do all these things back but you had that you know you had that downtime to be able to train yourself so basically you have to look at it like that you might have been upset about that other job but it was just like it's gonna pay you just a few dollars more but then for you just patiently waiting and waiting for that blessing to come in look at you you don't got a job that's paying two times more probably got a good medical plan good vacation time or whatever 401k i mean just gave you everything that you've basically been needing because of your financial problems you're like you know the husband or the wife is getting upset because i'm not spending enough time at home because i'm so busy working you end up getting you know and that and that falls right in the line. You'll be able to have a job that you get paid. You know, it, it makes it easier on the family for, you know, different different reasons. And, you know, you get to spend time with your family. So that's why I need y'all to look at certain things that we have to go through. You know, we get pissed off about it. And trust me, I know. There's times where I get upset about 
the things that has been delayed out or you know the mistakes I've made because of the delays so it's just I learned from them things I had be able to accept responsibility on the the track of decision I end up making because of the situation but end up turning out good in the long run you know end up being a blessing in the skies for me so it's just like you have to be grateful for all the things that you know that those delays and things that you know probably could have harmed us in the long run anyway because it's just like when you go for jobs or you know you might want to to get this apartment or something like that I remember there was a house that I seen that was perfect and it had all these bedrooms and it was cheap price and it lived you know and it was an all right area that you know you can be in but you know there was always a catch to it, it was, come to find out the realtors don't like fixing up things and everything and I was like yeah that house would have been good but when something broke down it was like I would have been paying out more money you know to get something fixed or whatever then you know being a place where I can be where I can rely on maintenance and rely on this or you know if I can have somebody come fix it or whatever but it's just like you have to think about things like that so I had to talk about oh, okay and then come to find out you know this house is known for getting robbed so I'm just like oh good it was a blessing that I didn't get this house so it's just like you know you have to be able to um you know, just sit back and look at your things the way you go through it and and just be grateful for the delays and the mistakes that you have made along the way of, you know, finding yourself and find that, that positive path that you're trying to lead yourself towards. So it's just like, you know, there's times I tell y'all, I keep it real with y'all. There's days that I, I'm just like, I'll get so upset, like, dang, you know, I'm just really, 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 uh, really, really really ready to go <laughs> and get out of this situation and also, I don't know why I got tongue tied off of that but you know when you're ready to go and leave a situation into a better one and it's just like we have to learn from those things we have to be able to process them train our mind of thinking a certain way instead of drifting off you know into that negative thought process because something has you know trigger that you know we have to be able to learn like okay there's a reason for everything that happens you know and it could be some rough stuff and it could be some traumatizing stuff but everything has a reason for happening the way they happen I mean I you know I like I said I do research and I learn things and it's just some of the things that I go through is just life experience on my own and it's just you know like I said before you know allowing myself to be open and vulnerable to that point where you know I blog about it every day or you know or there's things that I'm talking about that I feel that you know that come from up there that I need to expose here so it's it's when people can be on the same level as me you know be on the same level as you when you're out and about is a good blessing because that's truly hard to find you know especially with people like us because it's like you can't just go up to anybody and start talking about the stuff we talk about they can be really thinking we're crazy but it's just you know people are close-minded like that but it's just allow the things to happen you know if there's something that you can correct you know in the future when things come up for you go ahead and pay attention to your instincts and your gut what is it telling you what you know knowing that there's things you probably went left when you were supposed to go right you were supposed to be putting something down when you said he was picking it up or you probably indulged yourself into things that you know you shouldn't even be indulging yourself in and I have to tell myself that because a lot of memories will come back or there's things that will be shed into light for me and it might make me feel a type of way like wow really <laughs> you know that's messed up but you know you know things happen so basically like I'm saying it's just like you know there's things that happen to us for a reason and it can be some of it can be upsetting some of it can be very traumatizing but at the end of the day when we heal from these things it has taught us a very valuable lesson on things we have learned so many things from our setbacks we have learned so many things on our goals that we have set upon ourselves or not even really say goals but the things the milestones we were able to get over 
you know, you have to be proud of yourself for doing those things. And that, because a lot of people wouldn't have been able to accomplish the things that you have experienced or you had to, you know, ex- you know, experience or just had to deal with through life. So you have to be able to give yourself that pat on the back. Allow yourself to know we are all human. We are not perfect. All of us have past, you know, past. All of us have experienced where we had to learn from them. Some things were petty. Some things were stupid. Some things might have been straight up like, really, did you just do that? You know, but, you know, we all had to experience these things. We all had to go through them, and we grow and learn from them. So allow yourself to learn from the mistakes that you make. Allow yourself to grow from the delays that you have because there's probably something that you needed to explore about yourself before you're able to receive that next step. So don't be disappointed when you're not able to get it right now because there's something that obviously you need to take care of on yourself as I do the same for myself, you know. And, you know, just get it right. You know, we're going to have to keep going through these lessons until you can get them right. So I hope you are able to get something out of this message. Send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. I don't know why I got tongue-tied, y'all, earlier. It's just messed up. Especially if you just think about so many things at one time. I guess that's what it was. But anyways, like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. Drop me a line. I love to get the positive feedback. And I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even if it's about opening up about your, your empathic gift and how it is it impact your life in a positive direction <coughs> excuse me and go ahead and give me a thumbs up on your social media favorites or you know just share it with your loved ones or friends but know that you are blessed you are highly favored and truly loved and know there's always somebody out there praying for your better days so much love and light and healing loving vibes towards your way and much love and light and namaste. Peace and be wow.